So now let us look about uh, difference between this uh, super method, uh, this method, and super keyword, and this keyword. Very important. Most of us will get confused here. Okay. Let me make it very simple for you guys. Okay. And you can use them anywhere without any uh, without any doubt, friends. I'm sure that you can use them with uh, a very good confidence. I'm sure that you can use them with very good confidence. Now let me put what is that? Uh, what is that? super this this when this and all what call to the no argument constructor of parent class and what is this call to the no argument constructor of current class and what is this super uh, here this super represents what uh, it is what a keyword okay it is a keyword getting it is a keyword okay this super represents what a keyword and this represents what is also a keyword both are meant for referring static and uh, instance members uh, this super is going to refer what uh, static and instance members of super class i'm going to prove that one and we are having only one restriction i will tell you okay try to observe this one clearly most of the guys are committing mistakes here okay and this is going to get refer instance and static members of current class getting try to understand friends okay and what is this uh, it is meant for what uh, super meant for what Ah, super is meant for what? Call to no org constructor of parent class, right? Constructor of parent class, right? Of parent class, and this is meant for what? Ah, call to no org, okay? No org constructor of what? Ah, no org constructor of current class, okay? Of current class okay and now here here super is meant for what to refer a uh, to refer what static and instance members of super class very important guys it's very important in this case the subclass instance must and should be there okay as you go and do practice definitely will get to understand that one okay now try to observe super is meant for what a uh, to refer to refer instance okay instance or static okay or static members of members of parent class okay of parent class that can be available at anywhere if there are 10 parent classes in which parent class that one is available that parent class thing only it will be getting inherited that's very important friends okay now see here another one is what this to refer what instance and static members of uh, of current class of which class of current class and now coming to the next restriction it can be that is uh, this thing this all three it can be used only within the constructor only as first statement only uh, only once o3 that's it finished see here what is that o3 what is that uh, only only within the constructor as uh, sorry only within the constructor getting only within the constructor whatever the constructor it can it may be parameterized constructor of user defined one and parameterized sorry para, i mean user defined no argument constructor or default no argument constructor it must be used only within the constructor uh, other one is what uh, only as first statement only as first uh, statement another one is what uh, only once either of these two things must be used that is o3 only within the constructor only as the first statement only as uh, only once only within the constructor only within the con um, only as first statement only once getting o3 okay and now here uh, no restrictions we can use uh, we can use super or this both the keywords okay both the keywords can be used any number of times anywhere anywhere any number of times anywhere except at uh, at static areas okay it's very important okay that is very important you have to remember okay that only we are going to use in our higher modules of java whatever it may be spring hiber hibernate struts or web services okay now this can be used uh, we can use super at this uh, uh, anywhere okay anywhere any number of any number of any number of times except ah uh, 
except except at static area otherwise there will be a uh, non static variable that particular keyword should not be referenced from the static context like that it is going to give the compile time error okay and now what is that uh, only within the constructor only as first statement only once and this can be used anywhere anywhere within our class except at static area on any number of times that is very important that's it if you do remember these two things and uh, everything is going to get finished now before i go for that one i'm going to use this super and this i'm going to refer static uh, members of our uh, of our class it's very important okay most of the guys will get confused super and this can get used anywhere except for static area and you can do refer static members also that is also very important friends so, try to observe this small piece of code what is that uh, class a within this uh static int i okay int i is equals to triple line and what is this public static void main string array okay uh, let it be now i am going to uh, define uh, define one instance method public void m1 method and within this sop of and of course let me take one of the parent class class b okay and let me put here as what extends uh, extends b and here let me take what static uh, int uh, int i minus triple line or else let me take what uh, let me take what just uh, minus 9 let me take what just uh, minus 9 and this one is what the static okay and this one is what friends static okay static okay now let it be of course by default whatever the parent things were there i mean through constructor we are going to get achieve of course by i mean by default this static will be available to us no need to worry but let me make it very clear to you that by using super and this you can do refer what ah uh, static and instance members also everyone is very clear about instance members let us go and discuss about static okay uh, that is what here okay now here let me put what ah uh, here let me put what super dot i and let me put here what is the other one sop of this uh, dot i now observe now i am going to create what one instance what is that a uh, new new a getting new a dot uh, new a dot on this reference of course there will be here one reference to us hexadecimal number and that only i am going to call m1 method not directly see here see here a a equals to new a so what is the meaning of this one there will be one instance of type what a uh, a with this, along with this instance methods are going to get associate we have seen this one with very good explanation a uh, along with this a uh, static members will not be getting associate here what is that here a uh, m1 method with some implementation okay and uh, now it is going to have one reference that reference i am going to put into a right of type so let it be as what a getting i am sorry ye 1 to ye both are same so it is going to refer this one it is of type ye now here instead of holding this reference on that reference only it is an anonymous one and that it is going to get used only once we are not storing that reference for our future use that's very important okay and now try to understand here without using this one i am calling m1 method which is always a valid thing if you go for any competitive exams uh, that i mean if you go for any interviews or if you go for any competitive exams you will be seeing the instance creation in this type only getting and, uh, and also in our certification exam this one will be there okay and now and now what is this m1 now what will be the answer super dot i is what uh, is minus 9 and here we are having what triple line getting this is the answer by using super and this uh, you i mean you can do event refer what static members that's very important see here i have used uh, super and this uh, only within the instance area and of course you can do call uh, this uh, super super data any number of times no restrictions we'll see that one also see here you can print uh, once again you can use what sop of what uh, super dot i and also you can use what uh, this dot i getting of course it will give the answer as what once again minus 9 and triple line here okay we can use any number of times we'll see that one now let us see this small piece of code okay try to understand friends okay now 
yes the same piece of code whatever i have written overboard but thing is what class names are getting changed okay than that nothing friends this is what one of the static member and same ah uh, same identifier i within our child class and also within our parent class okay this is what the main method and i'm accessing them ah uh, accessing those identifier by using what super and this super dot i means what it is going to refer which one parent class i so minus 9 here it will be the answer as what triple 9 okay now try to understand now i'm going to compile that piece of code okay java c c o n s t you getting dot java and here if you do observe what is this construct a parent is the class name in which a main method is available getting here the main method is available now go and uh, go and construct right of course i'm sorry java c java c construct uh, yes this one right now try to observe now you are going to get minus 9 triple nine as the answer okay so if you do observe this one what is happening here you can do refer what ah in st i mean static members also it's very important okay and now we can use these things any number of times right try to observe here i'm going to use three times okay same answer minus triple nine minus triple um, minus nine triple nine minus nine triple nine minus nine triple nine will be the answer so code has been changed so let us compile this one once and let us go and re execute it okay minus 9 triple 9 minus 9 triple 9 minus 3 tri triple 9 why because three times i have used the same things okay and now now the same piece of code same piece of code now i'm going to take what instance members okay instance members okay now instead of static put this one as what ah uh, put them as what non static then that nothing we can do refer what instance members also same piece of code try to understand friends okay try to understand friends okay now see here i'm going to take this static and also here also i'm going to take this static okay and now try to observe the same piece of code nothing change same piece of code nothing change how many times minus 9 triple 9 three times observe getting minus 9 triple 9 just for your uh, just for your just for your understanding purpose let me put some debug statements extra change it okay change it with instance okay instance okay now try to observe okay now instance will be there okay see here change with instance okay three times okay uh, this is what that particular uh, difference between super method that is called to the no argument constructor of parent class and this method that is called to the no argument constructor of current class and what is the other one super and this both are keywords which are going to refer what instance and the static members of what parent class okay parent class now let us see how we can do refer here i have used what data members now how to refer what instance i mean static services and instance services it is so simple try to observe the same piece of code same piece of code but thing is what i'm not going to put all of these things okay try to observe friends okay try to observe this thing okay let me take all of these data members also okay now here try to observe i'm going to take one of the static method what is that ah uh, static uh, return type is what string let it be the method name as what m2 method now here return what something what is that hello getting hello getting and now now i close this particular static method now let me close this entire uh, entire class a getting and now try to observe here within this uh, m1 method sop of what uh, this dot uh, this dot uh, m2 method getting it is returning something that's why i have put that one as what an argument to the uh, sop statement that is println statement system dot out at println now it is also a valid thing what is this static method try to observe here and of course this has been used only in instance area but not in static area that's very important okay try to observe the same piece of code i'm going to compile now okay now try to observe this one okay try to observe this piece of code okay and of course here it is what uh, static method instead of hello i have taken here what uh, super this is from static area and here what i have taken the here uh, try to observe here this dot m2 okay now let me go and okay i will take all of these things okay no need to worry okay and now try to observe this one i'm going to compile this code once again uh, compile successfully now run this one it is going to give answer to us okay observe 
super or this from static area getting very important friends okay uh, now 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 observe here okay and of course this is what instance uh, uh, instance method right we can do access instance method directly from other instance method no restrictions okay no need to go for that one okay